Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover how to store image file in the database using uh, JDBC program. Uh, to store image in the database, uh, what we have to do is uh, first using Java application, uh, we have to read the image file. Okay, once uh, we read the image file, then convert this image file into uh, binary information. Then uh, using a prepared statement, uh, we can uh, store this binary information in the database. And uh, this prepared statement has uh, set binary stream method. So in this method, uh, we have to pass the column index and the binary information. Then uh, when you call a prepared statement dot execute update method, it will uh, insert or update the binary information in the particular uh, table in the database. Okay. So basically, with the help of a prepared statement, we can store the image in the database. Uh, here you can see the signature of uh, set binary stream method which is there in the prepared statement and uh, there are uh, uh, two methods uh, the first method will accept uh, two parameters uh, parameter index and the input stream uh, the second method accept uh, three parameter uh, parameter index stream and length okay uh, here you can see the world database uh, in this world database there are three tables are there city country and country language uh, in this world database, I am going to add one more table called uh, city image and uh, this city image uh, table has uh, ID, name and photo. Photo I have uh, defined as uh, blob uh, because uh, the binary information we can uh, store it in the blob column only. Okay, And I am executing this one and I am refreshing this. Uh, you can see city image uh, table has been created. Uh, the class uh, JDBC store image demo has a main method. So in this main method what I am doing is I am creating object of this class and then calling uh, store image method. Uh, in uh, store image method what I am doing is uh, first I am registering uh, JDBC driver and driver manager using class.forName method. Then uh, I am establishing connection to the database using uh, driver manager. This uh, driver manager dot uh, get connection method will return the connection object, and uh, then I am calling uh, prepare statement method of uh, connection object by passing the SQL. Uh, this SQL is uh, parameterized SQL. Uh, you can see three parameters, and uh, this connection dot uh, prepare statement method will return the prepare statement object. And once I get the prepare statement object. I am setting uh, each and every parameter which is there in this uh, query. Okay, so first I am setting the ID as one. Uh, then I am creating a file object by passing the file location in the file uh, constructor. Uh, the file name is uh, New York uh, JPEG, uh, which is there inside the D downloads. I am opening that uh, image. So this image. Uh, then using uh, prepared statement, I am setting the second column value as uh, file.getName. So basically this is uh, the image name. And uh, then I am passing this uh, file object to the file input stream. Uh, so this will return file input stream object. Uh, that file input stream uh, I am uh, setting to the third column. Okay. So third column is nothing but a photo uh, which will accept the blob. Okay. Basically uh, we can store uh, binary information in the blob. Uh, then uh, what I am doing is uh, I am calling execute update method of uh, prepared statement. Uh, this will insert uh, one new row in the uh, city underscore uh, image table. And uh, whatever uh, result uh, I got, I am just printing that. Then uh, after that uh, in finally block, I am closing uh, prepared statement connection and uh, file input stream. Okay. I will run this program and I will show you the output. Uh, here you can see uh, we got the output uh, number of rows inserted is 1. I am opening uh, MySQL workbench and select star from uh, city image. So here you can see ID is 1, uh, name uh, New York dot JPEG and uh, in photo is the blob column. Uh, the blob value has been uh, inserted. Okay, uh, so this is about uh, how to store image file in uh, 
particular table in database uh, next video tutorial i will show you how to read this blob information and uh, store it in the uh, directory file directory okay and uh, thanks for watching bye